It shall be. Malahe and Tezak have proven to be nothing more than puppets. The true master of this unfolding mystery continues to elude you. One thing is certain. Someone has taken a very personal interest in seeking your death. Though why, you are not sure. Your search for answers continues, and the foreboding Cloakwood Forest is your next target. Consider it done. I will do my best. Can I assist you? You want some whiskey? I got some cheap beer for ya. Mm. I gotta stop dipping into me falls, own ale. Your mind drifts back to events past, and to triumphs well deserved indeed. A fortified camp secluded and guarded from the entire coast, and it is not but easy pickings before your guile. All manner of bandit and brigand move about here but you may as well be invisible amongst them. Your recollections are interrupted by a powerful gust of wind, lifting you high above the camp and woods both. Your arc crests in the high morning sun, and for a moment you are as a bird, free from your duties to those below. With unseen hands, the earth reasserts her hold on you, and suddenly you feel less like a sparrow and more like a catapult stone. Without impact or fanfare, the ground accepts your passage and does not strike back. In a moment, all is black, and for all you know, you have descended to the very core of the world. The rock around you illuminates, and a cavern slowly takes shape. Though you can see no more than a few steps ahead or behind, stumbling forward, you find yourself face to face with yourself. Before you is a likeness in stone exact to the smallest detail. A voice in the darkness accuses you, even as it seems amused. Such pride undeserved, great predator, when your whole being is borrowed. Credit where it is due, and dues where payment is demanded. A dagger of bone flies from the blackness and strikes the statue square. It cracks slightly, but the pain you feel is as though you were rent asunder. You were made as you are, taunts the voice, and you can also be broken. You fall backward into the void and do not come to rest until morning wakes you. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. 